So I received a box from AJ's today. As you can see, it looks like they taped two boxes together. So hopefully this time when I'm cutting it, I won't damage the boxes. I try to be as careful as I can. They just split apart, but uh, the other boxes were a little different because they were the jersey boxes. And they taped them, so this should be pretty straightforward. Hopefully, I don't cut into the box. It's hard to. So far, so good. On my side. All right. Because they look like they're just basically sort of like the same boxes for jerseys, but like bigger versions. All right. So, let's figure out. Turns in his own zone. Approaching the last time I did this, I cut the little lips, so I'm hopefully I'm doing it for the right off. Holy shit. lip there. Yes! Calorie scored! Alright. Well, my team's been winning tonight. It's too bad my Leafs still weren't still in the playoffs. They might have actually, might have actually won if they were playing. I'm just gonna... I don't know why. This is a weird box. It looks like it's just fall off this way. I don't know if it just comes out. I don't know. Okay, there's nothing really attached to that. Oh, there we go. There. Okay. <laughs> oh, that, that's nice. Looks like an 11 by 14. Makes sense why it's so big. Nice. I'm just going to take it right out of the plastic ages. Always wraps is really good. Bubble wrap here. I'm going to put it back in. I want to put it all back. This is the first framed. Oh, perfect! That's hilarious. I think this is what I'm gonna. I might actually get another one just because, just because though it's not numbered is. It's number 40 out of 100, and I happen to be 40 years old this year. My man, Connor Brown. Uh, it's funny because I remember seeing him being interviewed on, uh, I mean, it must have been Hawk Night Canada when he was a kid and he had uh, uh, 
don't know if you know, uh, back when I was a kid, I actually had one in my room. It's like a little maple leaves kind of lamp, and it's like a scoreboard, and he mentioned that he had that as a kid, and I had the same exact one. So it's a really nice piece here. So it's got a Next Century Game autographed by Connor Brown. So it so has the date on it, 12 19 numbered 40 out of 100. So that's pretty sick. I like, I have that. Should have been wearing my Toronto Arena's hat. At. It's actually up there that I was wearing it earlier today. So that's the first one. It's got the COA from AJ's on the back. So it's a really nice frame. And it's like shrink wrap too in the front, so it just, so it just doesn't get uh, scratch or anything. So like they do a really good job by packaging it. So there's the first one there. I'm gonna put that back in the box. So there's the Connor Brown one. Now the reason why I mentioned that I might get another one now is because when I ordered these two, this one here, I think I got the last one because it's no longer on their site, whereas they still have the Connor Browns up. So. So for my for that price and for the sale price, I don't mind. So I wouldn't mind keeping them that hot one just because I'm 40 and it's 40 out of 100. Kind of suspicious that way. Let's see what number this one is. That's another reason why I got these first, because they're limited edition, numbered. So I didn't know how long they would last, especially them being leaves. So. Never know. Good. 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 I like how they tape all around. It makes it complicated to figure out how to, how to open it. So this one is from the Centennial Classic. Again, so it looks like it's the same type of frame. Again, numbered. Out of a hundred. After I show it. Okay, so this one is number 22 out of 100. We're sad to see him go. We could have used him in the playoffs this year. Nazem Kadri. Very talented guy. He's good Ontario boy. Just like Connor Brown. That is there with the AJCO in the back. And again, like I said, this one's shrink wrapped as well. So I'm just going to leave that on just to keep it uh, in good shape. And that's a nice Nas. Like I've gotten him before over the years quite a few times. And this is like, usually it's like a tight scribble, but this is a nice stretched out scribble. With a nice piece. So nice. No Nas. So it's from the owner class, like your favorite class. Centennial class, I guess, whatever. There's some different names. Anyways. Nice piece. So, like I said, this one when I got it, like it was, I think I got the last one or one of the last ones because the next day it was no longer, it no longer had it on the site. So, I'm excited to have these both. Uh, like I said, I'm probably, as of today, there's still more Connor Browns available. Uh, so, fingers crossed that when I get paid next Friday, there's still some available. So I will pick up another one, and I'm also going to pick up, they have some Cam Talbots, uh, some uh, Oilers limited edition Cam Talbots, and uh, they've been Emmons for 10 years, uh, great guy, and just watching the game right now, hopefully they can pull it out, there's 12 minutes to go in the third, they're down 4-2, uh, with the Dallas, so hopefully they can bounce back. Uh, they do have a one nothing lead, so um, he's been playing great this year. I love all those former owners. Him, uh, Luch, obviously, he's a great guy. Even though he killed my Leafs when he was with Bruins, I still love him. He's awesome. Great guy. And to Toby Reader, too, man. That guy's wicked. I uh, wish them nothing but the best. I'm cheering for the Flames. Like I said, three or four Marauders, and I lived in them for 10 years, so I got to know them pretty good. Uh, so I'm hoping they can pull it out and then get by Dallas. Although, Dallas does have Cogs, and Cogs is a great guy too. And even Taylor Fadoon, I didn't really know him too much, like, he didn't really play with the other girl, but Cogs has been with him for a while. Obviously, would be a long time over there. So, but unfortunately, gotta go with the Flames because they have more former Oilers and, and uh, 
I'm down with the Spike Douglas. As long as it's a good series and it's uh, competitive. So we'll, like, we'll watch the end of, end of this game here. It's 11 minutes to go now. And I finish my coffee and pack these babies back up and uh, see what I can get next check. So like I said, I'll probably grab one of those Talbots and if they do have the Connor Brown left, I'm going to grab another one. The price is right. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Have a good night.